the major domo handicap chase is next up this is a three mile and one furlong not to 110 uh, we've only got a small field for this one as well i think five i think for the top long-term project for graham clutterbuck rapunzel martin leader more stand lady matt cooper elvis for martin leader and leo's holiday for alex cherry i feel like just five then called in and away the nose banded elvis the first one to show race away from the stands Head out onto this back straight you can see the first fence in the distance there around this turn and Elvis is opened up by four lengths to long term project in second and Leo's holiday third Rapunzel is in fourth and Orchard's town lady is the back marker and all safely over the first Elvis has settled down nicely into the lead into the water with a five length lead of a long term project in second in Rapunzel better known as a herder in third and Leo's holiday fourth and the only grey in the field is Orchard's town lady out the back as they get over this ditch which they all jump nicely and get away from it well the pace didn't appear to be that hot but they're quite strong out as Elvis skips over that one in the lead from long term project second Rapunzel third Leo's Holiday 4th and Orchard's Town Lady 5th. Order pretty much the same as it was from the outset as they get over this ditch. Which again they all take nicely. It's downhill towards the next then with Elvis clear in front. More safely over that one. Elvis the novice in the lead. Leading by a good Six or seven lengths, long term project is second. Rapunzel on the outside of Leo's Holiday. And then finally, Orchard's Town Lady, the back marker. And over the next one they go, they're all over that one as well. Jumping's been good so far. She's bound to put the kibosh on something there. over that one nicely the rest of them over it nicely as well with leo's holiday now moving into second long-term project into third rapunzel's dropped back into fourth and orchard's town lady continues to be the back marker of the five oh, well strung it as they make their way into the straight i'll take two fences in the straight i think and then head out for another circuit Leo's holiday a bit slow over that one. And Elvis continues to lead, pulling for his head. He wants to go fast, and you can see he's not settled at all as they get over the next Leo's holiday. Another mistake. Don't very often see horses doing that this far into a race. Really pulling for his head there and wants to go a lot quicker than the jockey wants him to. He's already six lengths to the good. Term project is in second, Rapunzel is in third, Leo's Holiday is fourth, and Orchard Stand Lady is fifth. So coming to the next, they're all over that one again. With Elvis continuing to lead by five, probably down to four now. Whether he's being given a mid race breather or he's just getting a bit tired. Catching him up, Rapunzel was slow over the water. But Elvis continues to lead by about three and a half lengths. To long term project, who's got a five length gap back to Rapunzel in third. And then Leo's Holiday is a couple of lengths down in fourth. And Orchard's Town Lady is out of shot. And no way of knowing how far behind at the moment. And the next one they go, and Elvis is still going okay in front. Maintaining that four length lead. Long term project does look. Ready to pounce the top weight. As they race downhill now. Some tricky fences come up. This is a big ditch, and you can see the lead is now down to just a little more than a length. As he starts to niggle on Elvis. Long term project is 
getting closer. Rapunzel's getting considerably closer. Leo's Holiday is now dropping off in fourth, and I think Orchardstown Ladies probably booked for fifth. But it's Elvis who continues to lead by three lengths or so. At the fourth last, took that one really nicely. Got away from it well as well. Long term project in second. Rapunzel is in third. It's probably between these three. I've got three to jump. And Elvis has led all the way so far. Took that one nicely. So too did long term project. Rapunzel a little bit slow. And now Leo's Holiday is starting to get going again. So maybe it's not between those three because Leo's Holiday is now starting to eat up the ground and has moved into third. Elvis has kicked on for home and now with two to go, two fences to go and three furlongs to go. Elvis is back five lengths clear. Long term project is in second and chasing Leo's Holiday is third. Rapunzel starting to look a bit one pace back in fourth. But it's Elvis who continues to lead then coming down to the second last fence in now in this major domo chase and he gets over it in the lead he's two and a half three lengths clear of it a long term project who looks to be going the better though of the two of them as they come down to the final fence Elvis has been in the lead all the way gets over it nicely over it two long term project these two men have got a furlong to go it's Elvis, two lengths clear, long term project is not getting any closer and Elvis is beginning to stretch out again and Elvis looks like he's going to hang on and take it and racing up towards the line, it's one for the money, two for the show three to get ready, Elvis wins again and Elvis wins it from long term project second, Leo's on a third, Rapunzel back in fourth and then Orchard's town lady was fifth so the order didn't really change a lot throughout the race to be fair they all put in a good round of jumping as well. There weren't really any serious mistakes, and Elvis took that one nicely for Martin Lee. Long term project for Grand Crystal was second. Leo's Holiday for Alex Cherry, third. Rapunzel for Martin Lee was fourth. And Orchardstown Lady for Matt Cooper was fifth.